April 27th, 2019, the day we get the 1999 Subaru Legacy, whose engine we'll be using for the swap into a 1984 van again, which is right there. get this engine out, got my dad, got the hoist, uh, it's kind of hot, it's going to rain, going to get it done, here we go, everything should be about ready to do it, jacks are in place, getting all the finishing touches ready. Your Subaru has been in here for a week and a day, eight days, hopefully we'll get this thing out, well we'll, we'll get it out, just a matter of when. now the harness has been removed everything for sure has been removed the computer which was over there is removed probably gonna try to save that bracket maybe reuse it I even took off the shifter because I think I want to try to use that if I can and um, this guy is for the airbag so he's not important to me and all the stuff that goes here is in the box with the wire harness. And even these, which Mick says in his videos that you can cut, I just unclipped them. I clip, I cut very, very few wires. I mean, like, less than five at all. Okay, and then here's our computer over here. And then here's the back seat, which has all sorts of junk in it. Parts from the dash. There's that brace bar that goes across. It's a pain in the butt. All sorts of stuff over there. All right, so this thing is in its final stages of uh, basically taking everything out that I want to keep. So that I want to and that I need to. So, and then I'll be happy when it gets off my property, yippee. Today is Friday, May 10th, 2019. The day that will be known as the day the wire harness for the Subaru, the 1999 Legacy, is finally completely removed. Here is the engine. I've taken the torque converter off. And I was able to access it through the bottom, which everywhere I had seen showed you about this little access plate over here, which of course you cannot get to with everything on top. I didn't want to take everything off on top just to access the turquoise converter bolt. So my buddy Mick at Bustleroo said, yeah, you can access it from the bottom. And I did. And the torque converter came off and so did the flywheel, the plate behind it and also the oil separation cover which is plastic and i will be replacing it with a metal one well into the process here the engine is out i have yet to address any of the belts so that'll be this coming week we'll start looking at that and replacing the seals and following all those guidelines and then um i don't, might be just go ahead and just do the the 
uh, gaskets since I'm here and it's out. Might as well do as much as I can before sticking it in the van. Okay, and today we got the harness out. There goes the 99 Subaru Legacy Outback. It's going where the recycle cars go. Made a whopping $40 for it. It's Wednesday, May 15th. Had it for mm, two weeks, almost three weeks. Not quite three weeks. So, happy to see it go going to be putting the van back in that space. Yay. Finally. Mm -hmm. 